Oh, we can still do this. Yes. He's, he's out of here. Um, okay. On fire. On fire. On fire. And then this person, we're just going to come in and kill him. Okay, there we go. That was, that was so much easier now that we had a plan. Hello everyone, Time to Grind here, and today I wanted to play Gem Wizards Tactics, and it is a turn-based tactical game with randomly generated maps and asymmetrical uh, factions and stuff like that, and uh, Indie Boost and the developers of uh, Gem Wizards Tactics actually are sponsoring today's video uh, to kind of show off the game, and so I just wanted to kind of give you guys my first impressions of the game, uh, you know, checking it out and stuff like that, so we're going to just jump into the tutorial here at first and kind of learn together how to play the game, so uh, certainly Surrender, which we've captured your roll guard. It's over. Help! Hmm, I need to rescue that roll guard. Together we can defeat this enemy. This is a game all about playing creatively. Be on the lookout for devious strategies. This short tutorial will show you some of the basics. Move your units by left clicking on them once to select them and click again where you'd like them to go. Simple enough. If a unit has a blue exclamation mark point, it can be rescued and added to your party by moving adjacent to it. Attack the enemy by moving adjacent to him and clicking on him. Kill, click con again to confirm the attack. So, I like the art style here. It's got like kind of this awesome pixel art. So we're gonna go here. Um, and then we just click him. And so we're gonna deal two to four damage. I'm gonna take three to five damage. Um, and we'll attack him. So that's kind of what he attacks back. We're gonna just, oh, we, uh, <laughs> okay, we, we failed somehow. So let's, 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 let's get this. Um, oh, you wanna know what I should probably do? I should probably go and rescue this guy first. That seems like a little important because then we can send him. We can, uh, you know, deal some attacks. Oh, capture enemies flag by defeating and move the roll guard green to add him to our scard. And then we def, you know. Oh, he, he could, okay. Do we just have to kind of end our turn here? Gotcha, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. So wait, what does this roll guard do? I think like, cause yeah, he's, there we go, there we go. Okay, victory, we've taken enough flags to win the battle. Farmer, we need that flag, flank him to avoid taking damage. Yes, sir, ma'am. Uh, when you attack, enemies will counter attack uh, unless they're flanked. Flank by moving at least two units on an opposite side of the enemy. Okay, so that's how we kind of prevent them from doing the counter attack. So we're gonna move this guy right here. We're gonna move this guy right here. Now he's flanked and uh, we can go ahead and attack him because I guess which one they're, okay, they both be about the same. And then can I get this guy? There we go. Uh-oh, I don't feel so good. You need to step away from that river, roll guard. Grab me a few gems if you could. Many units have special abilities. Some of them require gem power to use, which you can gain by picking up gems. Pick up a gem so that you can use Andromeda's powerful storm ability on an enemy. Note that gem power is shared for your whole team. To use the storm ability, move into range, then left-click the spell icon, then left-click the target. So, okay. So this is our health down here, all of our abilities, and our action points here. Okay, that makes sense. So capture the enemy storm flag, collect a gem, and then use Andromeda's storm on the unit with three health. So this is Andromeda. So we're gonna have this guy go ahead and pick up the gem there. We're gonna have this person storm zap a unit for five damage. Uh, that tile and all adjacent tiles get wet. If striking a river tile, all connected. Oh, okay. So we're gonna just hit that, and then they all they all they all they all die like that. Okay. Okay. I see. I see you. Um, we'll move this person close by. We'll start bringing the roll guard close, and I think that's all we can really do with our turn here. So he's gonna hit us. But, oh, cause we retaliate too. Okay, that makes sense. We've taken enough flags to win the battle. Splash Masters. Now nah, we got this. Looks like he just needs a little splash is all he needs. Uh, is if It's something possible to knock an enemy completely off the map, killing them instantly. Try using Splash Master's Splash Blaster ability on the enemy unit. Make sure to check out the tooltips bottom right. If you hold control, you can get more information. Um, as well as show shields on enemies, making it easy. Okay, so he's got three shields. What does that mean? Capture enemy flag. If a unit is pushed off, they're instantly killed. So these are our guys, right? Shoots high pressurized water in a single direction, so we'll just move uh, here, right? And then we splash master. There, bam! That's easy enough. 
Oh man, I'm freaking out. Retreat. Different units have different attack and defense stats. Working around these is crucial. There are different kinds of terrain, grass, forest, river, and so on. Each have their own defense modifiers for units standing on them. Capture enemy squad, leaguer's flag, take advantage of the terrain, consider letting them come to you. So, these things, like the forest, give us more defense. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna just kind of position ourselves up on the forest, I think. Um, unless there's anything. Creates water, heals for one HP on the tile. Uh, what was this guy able to do? Shoots high pressurized water. Um... Okay, we'll just end our turn. We probably could have caught the gems, honestly, so if we lose this, we probably just need to get the gems, but... So two damage, but then we deal three back. This probably is probably not the best at, like, defending a, defending back, but... Um, okay, here, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and... If we do this... Hit that guy. There we go. Jeez Louise, these creeps are gonna cream my corn. That farmer is in big trouble and I can't get there in time. You've got to roll me, use Gale. Many units have passive buffs located just above the skill icons. Rolly guards have Rolly Poly, which makes them roll until they hit something when pushed. Combine it with Andromeda's Gale or other abilities. When on a castle, you capture it for one flag. You need full action points to do this, so you'll have to end your turn after moving there. So we need to move to the castle, which is, uh, I think, right, yeah, right down there. I uh, use Andromeda's Gale upright to instantly kill the tower guard. So what is this? Roll guard, Gale, upright. Wait, so does that mean I can... What, come right, right here? And then have this person come here and push there? Is that what I was wanting? And then we hit, right? Okay. There we go, okay, 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 I see. I see how we do this. Um, we're then gonna just move this guy here. Oh, that was his AP. I was gonna use some of those gems, but. You might just have to die. <laughs> you might just have to risk it. Actually, he's taking like no damage whatsoever. I ain't worried about him. Okay, we'll just come here and do I just automatically capture it? I think we just automatically capture it. So we'll go ahead and, I don't know, lightning down some people and attack. And uh, I th think we just end our turn here, right? Oh, we got the farmer, but okay, yeah. We just end our turn. So we, oh, okay, there we go. I think you have to have full, I think that's what it was. You have to have full thing. Oh no, too many bad guys. So this is this is actually pretty, pretty interesting. I could see this game getting like really, really in depth. We win missions by capturing flags, not winning fights to the castle. Run away. In a real mission, the enemy spawns indefinitely, so they'll usually outnumber you, but you don't have to defeat them all. Go after flags. Please read the help for more info. Okay, yeah. So we're gonna just um, come here. We're gonna have this guy come there and we'll have this guy come here. That's all we can really do, so we'll end our turn. We're gonna have this army of people coming after us. Okay, so we're gonna have just the, f oh, can any of them get in? Okay, this guy can get in. We'll have him there. And I don't know, we're just gonna move our guys back to kind of defend him and we'll end our turn here. Oh, that guy's like actually bulldozing the forest, I think. That's interesting. Okay, well here we just we just capture. Excellent work, we'll liberate our home. There's still a lot to learn, uh, but you're on your way. I recommend you play Derby Story next before diving into the campaign or ranked modes. Oh, so there's actually, um, I think there might be ranked at some point or something. But uh, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll jump into some Derby Story. You are Derby Pocket, a young enthusiast, enthusiastic recruit working for the business demons. You've been asked to secure deployment, development operations in Terra de Palm, the homeland of the potatoes. Oh, this is this is some this is some deep lore here, guys. I've been working this land for 30 years. You need to get deaf. Oh, 
So I don't know what I'm doing. I apologize. You need to get off my property right now. You don't understand. We're trying to help you, dude. Oh, I've seen plenty how you all are helping us, potatoes. Tell us what. We don't need your kind of help. Now scram or else. Hold on. Just hear me out. Bill Minton has this awesome plan for this area. I'm telling you. No, nah, no. Nah, I ain't letting you do it, Andromeda. They're here. Oh. Okay, so we gotta kill these people. So these guys' abilities, dash attack, move one talent in a direction, then strike all adjacent enemies for fire damage. You also got the blazing yardstick, um, which is to an adjacent unit and leave a flame. If there's already a flame, double the damage. Okay, and these people have flamethrowers. So are we just, oh man, okay. Deal two damage to two units in a line, leaving flames on the tile. So we need to move this person down and then we'll go ahead and flamethrower that. And I guess we can't really fire so we're gonna do the same thing here cause the flame and I'm assuming okay here we go and then we're gonna do that main ability there's extra things so we're doing double damage there and that's their health I guess so okay okay solid enough oh you're just they didn't even both do something so We'll just... Can we just do a normal attack? There we go! Okay! We got that settled. Um, I Is my guy on fire? Oh, fire immunity. Okay, I was like, that's... That's a little concerning. <laughs> um, deal, okay, yeah, we'll take that. Heads up, the enemy outnumbers you, so just attacking enemies won't do the trick. In order to succeed, you'll need to use your special abilities and flank. I already used my special ability. Have a little bit more faith in me, right? This guy's got one HP. Intern, are you done evacuating that area? Hi, Bill Derby here. Yeah, it's all clear now, although we saw some really weird stuff. Yes, the potato people are quite exotic. I'm glad you're taking time to appreciate their culture. Well, yeah, but I meant we... Intern, I need you. Some terrorists and criminals are destroying property and causing havoc. Okay, boss, you got it. I'll be right there. I'm hanging up now. All right, see you later. That was really weird. Was it? Bill hangs up on me all the time. I mean, the weird, scary horse potatoes. Anyway, there's no time for that now. We got to get to Lake Syria. Syrah. Okay, I, I could see I could see this having a really fun campaign, honestly. This, this, is, this is pretty interesting, honestly. Thanks, Rupert. You're here. We're getting overwhelmed. Oh, man, what happened here? We were transporting this prisoner for the business team, and suddenly all these weirdos came out of nowhere. Let me see if I can reason with them. Hey, assaulting these nice hired mercenaries is not only against the law, it's also against our policy. Laughs hysterically. Wow, get a load of this, Ruby. Ha, what a bootlicker. Wait a second, didn't I? Oh, I skipped that. Um, oh, yeah. Hi, please do not fraternize with this terror. She bombed two bridges yesterday. Yep, and I'm coming for Fort Bulls next. That is that is a not pleasant person's face to look at. Hey, that's seriously uncool. Do you think I'm uncool? Okay, here we go. Oh. What? Who did that? Potatoes do not necessarily... So this is a catapult, a turtle put, splash master. Um, we could get this royal guard, right, if we go up next to him. So let's, let's try to go see if we can get this royal guard here. Um, we're going to kind of set a perimeter around here. Because I'm pretty sure I could go to that royal guard. Oh, they're coming close. They're coming close. Oh, dang. Okay. So let's see. Oh, I can control this guy now. I don't know if I could control him the entire time. But okay. Oh, here we go. There's two fire there. We're going to move this guy down here. Two fire down there. Killing both of those guys. And then we're going to come... Or what is this? Move one tile in one direction, strike all adjacent enemies for three damage and knock them back. Wait, so if I move here, I could then do this. Nice. Okay. Oh, they're no longer in the fire. That means I get. I thought they were gonna catch on fire, um, which I guess they did not. But we should. We potentially. No. Nah, okay. That was not a good. That was not a good trade deal there. But we can move this guy over here. Kill that guy. And I guess we attack first, so obviously if we kill them. Um, and this person is not 
uh, fire resistant. Um, they are at the start of their turn. They have and they have at least one ally adjacent. They heal themselves and all allies for one HP. I mean, we might as well do that, right? We're gonna take some damage, but we kill that guy, and I guess we'll heal. So that'll be our turn here. Oh my dude, he just dealt four damage back, dude. Two damage back. They're just killing themselves here. Oh, oh, no, come on, don't die, don't die. Okay, we gotta we gotta chill out here a little bit. Oh, he got healed, see? So we're gonna just catch on fire. We're gonna catch on fire. <laughs> we're gonna just catch on fire. <laughs> so if you have the gems, you could just you could just spam those abilities. Nicely done. You too, man. You rocked it. Love that large shield. I gotta get me one of those. I gotta take this prisoner back to Fort Bulls. Thanks for your help, Derby. Derby, yes, now I remember. Derby Pocket. Do you remember what I told you during that fight we had? Was it before or after I beat you? Ha, I won, actually. Remember I used the Accursed Loom? All right, take her away. Derby, you gotta ask the bigger questions here, pal. You're on the wrong side of this. Also, she said she was gonna bomb the bridge she's being brought to, so I'm assuming um, that character gets out somehow. That's my, that's my hot... Hot a thousand IQ take here. I'm exhausted. Played rollerball for like all day. I wish I could have joined you. Yeah, we got five points. This one play I rolled like 30 yards. I got a double points. You should have seen it. I wish I had my day. It was horrible. Uh, it was just a lot of stuff. I don't want to bring you down. It's just I don't. Some people take this stuff for granted, I guess. Eh. Agneth? Nah, never mind. I know that sound. Eh. It means you disapprove of something. What are we doing here, Derby? It's like Bill says, we're helping rebuild Terra de Pom. And why does it need to all be rebuilt? Because we destroyed it. That was wrong, I know, but that was a long time ago. Now we're here to help mm, and make a huge profit. Why don't you ask your friends? I do like the new rollerball court they built near my house. How do you like it if someone came into the underworld and started helping us? So are we all demons? I'm, I'm trying, to, trying to figure out like the lore, the extended universe lore of this game. I mean, I don't know. If they were nice like me or like Bill, I'd be, haha, Derby, come on. Bill is not nice. Rich, sure. Smart, for sure. Does he even know your name? Of course he does. Intern is just like my official title. I shouldn't say this kind of stuff. It'll get me in trouble. Derby, you're a good kid. I just want you to know it wasn't always like this. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We're getting the extended universe lore. It's being made into an anime as we speak right now. Derby, help. Whoa, what's the matter? It's... I went... Pant, scary horse potato pant. It's all right. They're a side effect of Omni Gem. Something Bill's doing to the Omni Gem produces those. Anyway, I think someone is using them to attack us. Not sure how. I tracked a couple of those scary things, Reapers. They're called using these gems. So we can use them for that bulldozer. I think so. And for Agneth, anyway, be real careful. We're being hunted. Huh. Okay. So was this... Oh, so we are the... We got this thing now, which, what does this do? Bulldoze, stack bumping any units, can pave over mountains, cannot be used to bump an adjacent minion. Okay. Completely impassable. So they have to pass through here. Um, well, yeah, let's just have have him kind of go get his gems, I guess. Um, get all the gems. We got four gem power. I'm gonna bring him. And, oh, we don't have any action points left. That's... That is a mistake here. Okay. Oh, he got pulled. I got pulled in. Oh, what did they just do? Oh, they're clearing the trees. That is interesting that they can do that. Um, oh, Fire Mage. Shoots a fireball in any direction, dealing three fire damage to a unit and bumping it back. Okay, well, let's... I don't know. Do we just unload on this guy? Oh, no, no, I don't want to attack. I don't want to attack. Um, oh, okay, actually, we can... Let's get... Oh, that would take all the action points. This would take all the action points. Yeah, we'll just get them a little closer here. Oh, no, we... Okay, cool, we can... Wait. No, we can't attack that way. Um... I mean, yeah, we'll go there. Go here. We'll start getting all our way over there. And I guess we just use more gems to just do a ton of damage here. Oh, insufficient actions. Okay, so I, I can still attack, though. Which I probably... No, okay, let's do it. One damage. We take one, and they're sitting in the fire. Oh, okay, the fire killed them, too. Does the fire do two damage per turn? That's my guess. 
Oh, and then the entire place is like on fire here. So we're going to... I'm assuming, can this go over? It cannot, okay. Well, let's, let's use Bulldozer to get ready to bulldoze, I guess. And for the time being, I don't know, we'll just, we'll just sit here. We'll just end our turn, let them come to us. Oh, they didn't even move, okay. So we're gonna just bulldoze our way through here. We're gonna have this guy go back here. We're gonna have, um, let's see, two, and then two. Ah, uh, no, I want I want to go right here. We're gonna take a lot of damage there, but um, two, move one talent direction, strike all adjacent enemies for three fire damage and knock them back. This is only gonna hit him. I can't do it on him. I don't know why. Okay, well, we'll do that, yeah. Out of AP there. We can have our fire guys start coming in. Definitely don't want to cause a fire on us, though. Okay, I we kind of put ourselves in a little weird position here, not gonna lie. Oh, we dealt four damage back there, nice. Oh, jeez, five damage. This guy's already almost dead. Okay, here we go, fireball. We're gonna... Fireball. Oh, I thought it went through enemies. I don't know why I thought that. Reduces an enemy's armor by one. Oh, yeah, they got that armor. I see. Um, I don't melt that armor. Um, we can have this guy come over. That's that's all of his stuff. We'll have this guy come over. Do one damage, one damage. Um, there we go. Killed that guy. We'll have, yeah, this person come in a little bit more to potentially... Oh, that's the flank. Okay. Deal some damage. Can't attack back. Um, yes, we, if they're flanked, I forgot. That's a whole part of this game here. Okay. And turn. Oh, wow. Okay, she got down to like 1 HP. Um, well, let's kind of just set this guy on fire. It's like much as we can. Four damage there, two damage there. Thanks, Derby, you saved my life. It's so scary how they pull you in like that. I was exploring the woods on the other side of the Holo Hill. I'm pretty sure I saw the forest witch. Really? Whoa, we should go talk to her. She's not gonna listen, Derby. I know I wouldn't in her position. We should get back to camp. It's too dangerous out here. Agneth, I know I can convince her. She probably just doesn't understand. Besides, I keep getting called out to this area anyway. All these reaper attacks. All right, whatever. Okay. Is this where you saw the Reapers? I think so. Wait, I hear something. Invaders, betrayers, leave this place at once. Um, hello, my name is Derby Pocket. I'm wondering if we could maybe talk. I was, when you first came, I fled, remained hiding. For too long, I had ignored the plight of my people. No more, this occupation will come to an end today. Yeah, but we're not occupying you. According to the treaty, we, silence. You shall feel the wrath of Androm Andromeda Robin. Oh, they just, they just freaking kill. They just kill this person? Excuse me? Okay then. Um, was not expecting to uh, to have her just get yeeted like that, but uh, hey man. Okay. Here, what would this? That would give us like no action points. That wouldn't give us any action points. Let's just have him go get this, I guess. So everywhere he goes, he's like bulldozing this. Um, okay. Here. We're going to... Is there any way... Okay, we could do this, and then we could... Cause the fire there. Here we can... I don't think we can really do much here. Um, so we're gonna just... Yeah, get prepared to go fight this person. Um, I think that's really all we can do, yeah. Oh. <laughs> That counter attack, it's so satisfying. Like, I'm just gonna kill you. Yep, five damage. What do you expect in here? Two damage, three damage back to you. I love that, that's so satisfying. Oh, pulled me in. Oh my gosh, took that, that. That's a lot of damage right there. But yeah, what is its ability? Can I see its abilities? Oh, no, do not want to just attack you. Um, okay. Move. Oh, wait, wait. Can we just push this person? <laughs> Dude, we just yeet him off the freaking cliff. Okay, bring this. start bringing this guy over here. 
Um, probably do some fire damage. Wait, why can't I move one tile in a direction and then strike? Oh, okay, I need to go back one. Okay, go back one and then we go... Nice, okay. It didn't really cause any fire, but we can keep doing it, I guess. But we can just really keep doing it. Okay. Um, except I hope that this guy doesn't do like four damage. He missed that. Did one hit, we're gonna hit back. Oh no, mission failed, try again, okay. Dang, okay. Let's try this again here. So our guy gets yeeted, yada yada. Definitely still wanna use this guy to push, push off. Um, so yeah, we're gonna just move him right in position there. Honestly, might as well just attack that guy. Um, I think we need to prepare better against this. That's my hot take. So, what we're gonna do to do that is have this guy kind of go on more. I wonder if I just can't even have anyone die. Cause that might be it, honestly. So these guys are gonna come in, counter attack, whatever. This guy's not gonna be do doing too much fighting because he's gonna just push the guy off. So yeah, we'll just let these guys attack us. That's no problem at all. Okay. So now we can move. Oh, that's gonna take two, right? Oh, we can still do this. Yes, he's he's out of here. Um, okay, on fire, on fire, on fire, and then this person. We're just gonna come in and kill him. Okay, there we go. That was that was so much easier now that we had a plan. Looks like he's breathing, but he's in bad shape. Help me bring him back to Fort Bowles. Hmm, do you know if Agneth has his own personal health insurance coverage? No, he's on the standard business demon plan, I believe. Doc just went through Ledger. There was a policy changed. Agneth isn't covered. Something about it costs too much to insure demons over a certain age. Oh, I'm alright. Just do whatever you gotta do and I'll figure it out. Okay, we almost lost him, but I think he's gonna be alright. I like how I like how even in this world, the insurance, like medical insurance, is a terrible thing. He's strong, he's been through a lot in his life. Listen, I gotta run this over to Dr. Jenny. Hang tight back in a few. Oh, this person's escaping. Sorry to bother you. I wish I could figure out the right things to say to get to get through to you. This Bill Milton guy, this whole operation with the business demons, now it's the Omnigem, but there's always some excuse for pushing the potatoes further and further back. It didn't have to be this way. I mean, it just wasn't always like this. What do you mean it wasn't always like this? You used to be something more than a terrorist? It wasn't always like what? What was it all wasn't it always like? I just mean not all demons are like the ones you're running with. The business demons just have a very strange ideology. There's no law of physics, no force of nature compelling you guys to evict people from their homes. Bill is accountable for the loss of life and the toll he's taken on the world. You are accountable and some part of me knows that you're better than this. Would you please have- you have no idea what you're talking about. You know what? I'm out of here. She can, that person's totally escaping. Also, this does seem like it's maybe f like the different factions. In turn, you're needed outside Fort Resheva. My name's Derby. Oh yes, of course, my apologies. Where do you need me to go? Apparently these fairy tales about the Andromeda Robin were actually true. She has plans to lay siege to the Omni Gem. I need security and I need it quickly. There are a few business dozers there already. Okay, sir, can I ask you something? Yeah, but make it quick. Are we like the bad guys here? That's not what you ask your boss. I don't think that's the way you ask it. Haha, <laughs> oh, in turn, first of all, there are no bad guys. There are simply different groups who have different incentives. That's all. For instance, you and I have the incentive to make people's lives better. It's the right thing to do. And what's the issue with us making a buck or two in the process? Unfortunately, some like these potato terrorists are motivated by irrational fears, religious dogma, and hatred. So as you can see, there are no bad guys, but we're the ones bringing electricity, new restaurants, golf courses, and so much more. Right, well, but Agnes said... That old fool doesn't know what he's on about. If he did, don't you think he'd be more successful? Instead, he works for me and for Peanuts and had his age. A very sad story. That one, I tried to help him, give him every opportunity, but never mind all that. You are needed. Secure the Omni Gem. Okay. Normally, like, I, I was kind of thinking about, like, just skimming past some of this, um, story, but this is actually kind of an interesting story of, like, the, like, you know, it's a gray area. Like, we're taking people's homes, I guess. Finally, what took you so long, intern? We're under attack. They breached our front lines. Get in there and burn them already. Burn them all. Intern, hello? It's Derby. What? What's a Derby? You know, Bill, you really aren't nice, but that's not really the problem. Oh god, a lecture from the intern now of all times. I would have done anything for you, but this whole thing, you don't care about the potatoes. You're just using them. You're using their land. You're exploiting them. Just like you're exploiting me and Agnes and everyone else. I tried so hard to get your recognition. 
doing what you wanted me to do. Maybe I need to find another way to get you to learn my name. Or we're just gonna... Wait, we're, we're just gonna literally start attacking our stuff? We're taking, talking millions in property damage if you do this. You're ob obviously fired, but that's the least of your worries. You've made an enemy today, and I'm not the kind of person who... Oh, I'm on the phone? Whoa, Derby, that was... We need to secure this area with the Omni Gem. Bill is too powerful. Will you help us capture these three towers, Derby? So these were the enemies, and now I'm just like, nah. Okay, okay. Well, so these are now my enemies. So who's, yes, who's on my team here? Oh, I'm, I, I get to play as these guys now. So, Reap gain one Dark Binding per adjacent forest. What is Dark Binding? One harvest is sold after you attack. Unless the enemy was killed, consume all Dark Bindings and deal that much magic damage. Oh, okay. Um, choose a unit. Pull it adjacent to you. Okay, so there's not really any bushes near here. I mean, there's that one. But we're going to just go straight in here. We're going to just deal... Oh, only one damage? That's not really... Just one damage to an adjacent, bounce it, make a warren on an adjacent forest tile. It attacks enemies within two tiles every turn, lasts three turns. This guy like makes like centuries? That's pretty sick. I will go ahead and just attack this guy real slowly. Um, and this guy's the splash blaster with the roll guard. So can we bring the roll guard right here? Bring splash master right here and freaking. Oh, we did four damage to that guy. That's awesome. Do one damage. This guy's tanking a lot here, honestly. Um, I guess we'll kind of move this guy forward. And we could probably... Let's see. Yeah, move this here so we can... Oh, we don't have enough gems. Crap. And there's no way we kind of already used up all of our turns here. Okay. So he attacked. We attacked back. Though I will say, I don't know in the, in the grand scheme of everything in the story, I don't know if it's the best thing to just like immediately start like doing acts of terrorism, whether you're, I don't know. That, that seems like a very drastic thing to do, but we're going to take a step back here. Oh, we need to get gems. That's what we're going to do. We're going to get a gem there. So this person can do their awesome move here. Do a ton of damage there. Um, and then we're going to do move here. We're going to kill that guy. Awesome. Um, soul harvest. Let's move here and do that. That way we can actually attack and we're gonna deal the extra damage as the soul damage. Awesome, okay. And now, let's get this guy in position for the Splash Master again. Actually, let's get some, let's get some gems here. Also, this turret here was completely pointless, but hey, that's okay. Uh, one to three, two to four, okay. Two damage, perfect, awesome. Awesome, awesome. Um, I think that's really all we can do here. So, go ahead and end our turn. Um, we'll go ahead and get this gem that seems important, and then we're going to just two damage, and then we'll do. Oh, we only dealt one damage there. Crap. Can we attack again? No, we cannot. Incoming. What's happening there? Are they freaking shooting cannons or something? So, um, okay, but we're gonna send this guy down. We're gonna have this guy kind of get that, get him ready to kind of shoot the water cannon thing. And this guy, I think, excuse me, I think I want to, like, get him here, and I don't know if it's going to be worth it, but I want him to slash the three forests there. Um, that would be kind of sick. To get all of that, like, extra magic thing. Oh, I think killing enemies gets gems. Oh, oh, it's spawning things. Okay, we're going to do the reaper thing. Oh, man, okay. That's not very good here. Um... Because if we attacked, oh man, okay. No, we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> take our damage and get out of here. Um, we're gonna have this person come here. We're gonna water blast that guy, do a ton of damage. Um, have this person start coming up here. Is it worth it to deal some damage here? I think so. I mean, we have a lot more health with that. Um, this person, go ahead and make a sentry to help protect against that in case they come that way. Um, and I think that's all we can really do. I wonder if they attack me. When I attack back, is it using all the soul stuff? I don't think it is. So we're just gonna... They're kind of going after me here. 
Oh, what? Does this get frozen? Slippery tile slide across a bumped... Um, let's just... Oh, do I not have the AP? Why do I not have the AP to... No water. Oh, end of turn in what? Oh, he uses like water. At the start of the turn, if this unit's in the water, they'll automatically refill their tank. Oh, well look at that. Um, okay, well we'll just come in here and we're gonna just blast this person here. Get out of here, we're gonna have um, this guy keep moving. We're gonna have this guy end his turn here. He's gonna take some damage there, but I think it's worth it. Water cannon guy up here. This guy come over here. Okay, I really hope the game doesn't like, you don't lose if one of your guys die. So we'll have to see, because this guy's taking a lot of, oh my god, this guy's taking a ton of damage actually. And more people are spawning, so we're gonna capture that. Um, we're gonna come here. Just use gems there. Ooh, just have this guy come in there. Um, man, I don't, I don't, if this guy dies and we lose, I'm gonna be a little sad. Just don't, don't lose the game for me. Okay, I think, I think we're okay. Player turn. He, 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 foo, 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 shroom. What, what was that? Okay, capture. Oh yeah, capture three flags without losing all your units. Okay, so we've got that, f or... Wait, why can't we capture this one? Oh, did we capture that one? Two more to win. Why Why didn't we capture... Oh, oh, does this guy have the flag? What's going on here? Well, I think I could, like... Come here and just... Just push that guy off. Um, okay, so we got that handled. Our main guy died here, so I don't know how we're really expecting to get this other guy. Um, oh, there we go, capture that. Okay, so now we gotta start coming back up here. Um, <laughs> this is this is not, oh we, oh, oh, we probably should have done some of that launch stuff, okay. Okay, we just gotta capture this, but there's a lot of people coming our way. Oh, that enemy had a flag too. And I guess we only have to capture three of them. But hopefully we can just I don't know, they're preoccupied with that. Okay. Uh, launch, deal one damage to an adjacent unit and bounce it two tiles back. Oh, okay. Oh, bounce him off there. Okay. Okay. So let's just sit in the tower here. We're going to bring these guys as reinforcement here. Uh, use this guy as a distraction here. As long as this guy survives, uh, we, we win, I think. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, he dealt three back. That guy was... This guy died, whatever. Unimportant. It's a casualty of war. We are at acts of like terrorism right now. Okay, let me capture it. Why can't I capture it? Can I not capture it because there's people there? Um, in that case, bounce that guy away. Bounce those guys away. This guy still can't. Oh, okay, wait, wait. Shoot him away. Oh, but. Dang it, okay. I'm gonna use him as a meat shield. I think no one can be adjacent. Okay, we killed that guy, that's good. Um, yeah, we're gonna just meat shield for us. Do one damage there. Can we shoot anyone else? No, we cannot, okay. Okay, I think my guess is no one can be adjacent. I th so I think we should be good. We should be able to knock away the one person here. Oh, we also healed everyone. Okay, let's see. Um, then we hit this guy. Okay, can this guy capture? We can, we did it! We did it! Nice! Okay, we've taken enough flags. Hi, Andromeda. I wanted to say I apologize for my part in what's been going on. I thought Bill Mitten was like this cool, successful, brilliant guy. Anyway, the important thing is that I want you to know I am now a terrorist and the police are coming after me and it is all your fault. That's that's in reality what's what's going on here. Anyway, the important thing is that I want you to know Molten knows 
tells me that the fire major years survived my lightning attack. Yeah, he's gonna pull through, I think. Wait, who's Moten? He's my pumpkin. He can fly, so I have him doing renaissance. R r r how do you pronounce that word? Wow, cool. Hi, Moten. Moten. I love that face. That is the best. That is the best face. I must ask, what made you choose to betray your own people? I don't know. There's a lot I still understand about what's been going on here in Terra de Palm. I just, I wanted to be treated like a person. That's all the potatoes I've ever asked for. Can, could I apply to be your intern? I have no idea what an intern is. Actually, you know what? Scratch it. I don't want to be your intern anymore. An intern anymore. I guess what I'm asking is, can we be friends? I cannot become your friend as you are a destroyer of my villages. But if Bill Milton is your enemy, then you are at least the enemy of my enemy. So, okay. Still gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna recap this story here. This, this person just decided to become a terrorist in the context of their own people's eyes. Um... Because his boss was not treating him well. Oh, oh, we're, we're, we're letting this person out. Hey, we did it. We, we beat that little, um, congrats on completing Derby's story. The true battle is only just the beginning. Now try the campaign or experiment with some unranked games before heading into ranked. Oh, that was that was that was pretty freaking cool, honestly. Um, one thing I do want to do is I just want to go ahead. I guess there's missions as well. Um, ranked mission: play a random faction against a random faction on a random map. Win missions to rank up. Can you make it to rank 20? Okay, so it's not like yeah. Okay, definitely a single player. Um, you get business demons, potato. Looks like I have three of them right now. But let's go ahead and just do the some of the a new campaign right now. Um, so the Azure Order. Oh, and you can have like all the different like leaders and stuff like that. That is pretty sick. Um, or you have the Andromeda Forest people. Yeah, let's go ahead and just try the Azur Order. We we don't have the business demons, so let's yeah let's just try this guy. Um, let's let's try it, dude. Um, I guess we'll just keep it on Apprentice right now because I just want to kind of liberate your people, gain 100% liberation to win the campaign. Each battle you fight. Uh, gets harder as the enemy power grows, lose one battle, and the campaign's over. So let's just go ahead and play one mission here. I kind of see what the main kind of campaign is. Troops, charge into battle and be victorious. It's the only plan we need. Uh, I don't know. Go here. Choose up to five units. How do, how do I choose five units? I think I have five units, right? Oh, okay, yeah. One of my favorite things in life is dishing out orders. Oh, there's like a bunch of towers here. How many how many things do we need? Come on, Turtle Pult, launch me at him. Two more wins. Oh, okay, okay. I see what's going on here. Um, Reckless Charge, summon Ice Element. Oh, he can summon an Ice Elemental? Critting Flow. And this guy's Charge Attack Cavalry, Charge Attack Cavalry, a Bowmaster. Okay, let's yeah, let's just kind of go see what what some of these people are like. Just charge them in here. I don't want to go through like an entire mission. I want to like save that for another potential video on the future or something. But um. Oh, oh, there's someone over there. Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. I'm just totally like charging them out, like brute force in our way. Okay. Reckless charge, short file, four tiles in a direction, take two damage from mountains you pass through. Oh, okay. So I don't really want to be charging through these mountains here. Um, are there any gems to summon the elemental? I don't think so. So. Bump. Okay. So I think we deal damage equal to how much we charge here. Wait, does that mean I could like, no, there's a lot of mountains in the way right now. This guy going water. Just, just brute force our way through this. Oh, that probably wasn't worth it. Okay. Oh my gosh, we got bounced all the way. What? Is that what the catapult does? I think that was something the catapult did. Oh my gosh, there's a roll guard. Okay, wait, can we charge across rivers? 
Oh, wow, that's pretty cool. Bump an adjacent unit back. Let's see what this arrow person does. Um, or I guess this, this is in a real weird position here. I like where we could just totally charge, like, past stuff like that. Okay. I mainly just want to see what these people do here. Obviously, like, if you're playing this game a lot, um... You know, you'll kind of, like, learn all of the factions and stuff like that. Okay, here we go, here we go. Lob an arrow straight between two tiles away. Oh, he's just in a weird position. Okay. And we've used up all of the gem power stuff. Okay, so I mean, these guys are kind of just like charging in, you know, doing stuff like that. I don't, I, I, I think obviously I've kind of just been like going super crazy trying to show off some of this stuff. So this, this campaign itself um, is not the, uh, <laughs> good charge into the mountain, hurt ourselves. It's not the most serious one, but um, Man, this is this is Gem Gem Wizard's tactics, um, and it's actually uh, a lot a lot more interesting than I thought it was. I was not expecting there to be like a whole story mode, a whole campaign, a whole like single player ranked thing where you're playing with the different mission or people and stuff like that. So uh, it's, it's pretty interesting, and I just want to uh, thank um, Indie Boost and the developers behind Gem Wizard's tactics for uh, sponsoring today's video. They really helped me uh, keep the channel running and stuff like that, um, and so I appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video showing off a. Uh, a type of game that I don't play too much of, um, but it kind of has some of those like elements of randomness, you know, with the uh, campaign, you know, with the missions and stuff like that, with the ranked and stuff like that. So um, let me know if this looked like an interesting game to you guys. Uh, and also there'll be a link in the description down below if you want to check this game out as well. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, stay tuned for a ton of videos. Um, as you know, we're doing a ton more Let's Plays, so I, I hope you guys have been enjoying those. Um, and if you're going to be grinding out any games of Gem Wizard's Tactics, then I wish you guys luck and see you all next time.